Hello there, it's Lee from Lee Brogan DIY and Home Maintenance. Today we're sorting a ceiling out in the bathroom. Now, the ceiling itself has had a lot of years of water ingress and it was never miscoated, so the whole lot had to be removed. None of that paint stayed. So three to four hours of continuous scraping and sanding. We got all of the paint off, got it all cleaned back. This entire bathroom is in a similar sort of situation. Unfortunately, lady was ripped off previously. So uh, because it's such a big job, we're going to tackle it in little bite-sized chunks. Hello. Uh, got a ceiling absolutely destroyed. We had to scrape it back and open a massive tin of worms on this one because it's just got absolutely horrendous. Uh, previous guys painted no mist coat, so of course, moisture just got under a little bit. Once it gets under it, it goes that way. Uh, that's the state of, that's what's come off. It's just terrific. It's gonna be as much time tidying up as we are doing a job. So anyway, we scraped back, sanded it, Got it to a position where I think the paint's going to take. The paint is left on the ceiling, which is almost none. Um, I think it's paint overable. You'll notice, I don't know if you can see on the camera, on this particular area here, it's really shiny. That's where the plasters, what they call polish it, when they finish in, they've over polished it. So, of course, nothing's taken. So, what we've got is, you can see that, that is. 50 water, 50 paint, uh, it's called a Visco. So, in the process of throwing it up, that should seal the ceiling and we're ready to paint. So if you're ever doing painting doors and you said plastered, Visco is, is uh, a horrible job. But without doing it, your next coat of paint just, it will just stick to the, the dust in the plaster, not the plaster, so then it just peels. There you go. Welcome to my world. Start off easy, let's turn into a bloodbath. Anyway, so that's all the nuts and bolts. What we've done is miscoated, scraped all the paint off because you didn't want them little, when you, when you leave old paint on, you will see the step between old and new paint it just looks bloody horrible. Anyway, so we've got all of that off um, and then miscoated, made a nice smooth surface. Uh, Sanding wasn't gonna cut it on this one. Give it a good coat over, give it a second coat and a couple of places looks a bit patchy. That's because it's still drying out. And it was getting a little bit late in the day, so we got the video out as quickly as we could. Um, didn't give it a 100% uh, chance to dry. But uh, anyway, so it's mold resistant, moisture resistant. We're not going to be going back there. The customer's going to be happy. Achieved exactly what we said we were going to get it, make it look nice, look like a new ceiling. Like I said earlier, it's a massive job, so we're going to tackle this in little bite-sized lumps. Cheers now. Bye-bye.